My name is Charles Ng, and I'm currently an undergraduate at the University of Pennsylvania, where I'm studying business um, and computer science. Um, so our team's brief was on proactive community engagement. So with the introduction of new mobility systems like autonomous vehicles, uh, we wanted to find a way to help these city departments better engage with the public and better extract the needs from their city residents. So our prototype was Locomo, which is a part mobile application, part physical installation that allowed uh, city residents to um, mark or tag certain features within the city that they wanted to add to their daily commute or daily transportation routine. On Locomo, city residents can give various suggestions um, on what they want improved in the city or what they want to see in the city. Um, so this is just a map view of different sections and they're categorized. So for example, there's 26 suggestions in North San Jose. And you can also do um, a list view of what the top ranked suggestions are. So I'm just going to hit that here. Um, and then if you click on one, you can actually see what the suggestion was. So um, this is um, a suggestion given by a concerned citizen on what they want to add. So I'll play the video. And this is what um, an uh, augmented reality video looks like on Locomo, where someone can suggest that they want to see a bench next to a certain building. Maybe someone wants to add a bike lane. Um, if someone wants to see a bus stop near their house, they can add that feature as well. And basically by having these tags, um, other residents can view these videos and they can see the suggestions from other residents. So traditionally, city planners just use conventional surveys to um, understand uh, what their residents want. But instead of doing something that was top down, we wanted something that was more bottom up. So this uh, prototype helps city planners better understand the needs of their residents. And it also helps city residents uh, better demonstrate what they actually need to um, the people who are representing them. So, the purpose of our prototype was to have as many different tools as possible uh, to help these residents demonstrate exactly what they need, what they envision for the future, and what they want fixed.